Okay, we got it working. I'm kind of curious as to how it does recording. It's supposed to have anti-shake. I'm not really sure if it does. I don't even know if this thing has a microphone. It, it implies that it does. This is, I'm assuming, more of a vlogging type camera. And the reason why I'm kind of leaning towards the fact that it's more of a vlog camera is it doesn't really have very much in the line of telephoto. I mean, that's that's it right there until you get into, like, I don't know, I call it the super enhanced mode or whatever, right like that. I mean, we are talking about a smaller LCD screen, a 3-inch screen on the back, which actually is a pretty decent sized screen for a camera. Um, but, yeah. Let's see how it handles light transition change. We're going to go up into the trees, which is more towards the sky. And then we'll even bring it around to where it's a brighter sunlighted area. And come up to where, yeah, the sun is pretty, pretty well. And then we're going to go back out to wide angle and do the same thing again. I honestly think that that might make a little bit of a difference too. We're going to follow this tree branch up here. And as you can see, we're slowly getting to the sun. I mean, that's pretty hard on one, in my opinion, at least a camera, you know, to be able to handle the sun. <laughs> and we'll come back down again. See how it transitions more into a darker shader zone. Just to kind of see how it handles transition. Against the world, we're the perfect 